Hello everyone, I'm Jordan Kruger. Welcome to Tommy Media's The Locker Room. The 20th ranked St. Thomas softball team is 9-1 in Mayak play and leading the conference after sweeping a series with McAllister Wednesday. Coach John Cheetah reached the 750 win mark with the victory over St. Ben's last weekend, giving him the highest win percentage of all time in NCAA Division. I'm joined today by Coach Cheetah, Junior Annie Boyer, who's leading the Mayak in ERA, and Junior Mackenzie Worgen, who has a perfect fielding percentage and a 329 batting average. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. Coach, you just reached the 750 win mark and you're leading the NCAA in all divisions and all-time win percentage. What do these milestones mean to you? Nothing, <laughs> to, to be honest. Yeah. Really, uh, as a coach, you're always looking for your next, next, next. You're always forward thinking. Uh, if you look back at your past, you're the, the future will pass you up. So you just got to stay in the present moment and get ready for your next one. Annie, you only pitched one inning last year, and currently you're leading the MIAC with the 0.85 ERA. What's been clicking for you on the mound? It's really just been focusing on just hitting, hitting my spots, um, executing pitches, and it's m mainly everything that's in my mind, really having that confidence that I know that I can do it. I have one of the best defenses, most talented group of girls behind me, which is always what a pitcher can ask for. Coach, we know the winners in Minnesota have a very big impact on the spring sports season. How has this long winter impacted your team in terms of preparation for the season, and how has it impacted the games thus far? Uh, the games, it hasn't affected other than give us a couple home games that we wouldn't have had because the nice turf that we have, turf field, uh, melts it off and we shovel a little bit. So <laughs> shovel the field so we get a little extra workout in. But other than that, um, you know, our preparation, sometimes you don't have the tools you'd like to use for your practice, so it throws you out of whack. But, you know, you always say, so what, deal with it. So. Um, so for us, it doesn't affect us too much because we like to practice. Mackenzie, are there any difficulties being a utility player playing both the infield and the outfield? Um, no, I wouldn't say that there are. You do your best in both positions, and if you need the extra practice, you have to go do the extra practice for both. And now it's time for this week's fan question. Annie and Mackenzie, Junior Matt McMillan wants to know, how do you balance the rigorous schedule of being an athlete as well as balancing the act academics of St. Thomas and having a social life? Um, I would say that sometimes you have to sacrifice um, your social life for things like homework and then to go play sports. Also sometimes you have to stay up a little bit later but hey it's it's just what you got to do when you do it because you love the sport. I would just say it's just time management every even if it's just 30 minutes of the day, you just got to utilize it with, um, just take advantage of the time that you have to get the work that you need to get done in between practice. And then um, also, yeah. If you have a question, tweet it to at Tommy Media. Thanks for joining us. Be sure to check TommyMedia.com for the latest campus news. With coach John Cheetah, Annie Boyer, and Mackenzie Worgan, I'm Jordan Kruger. We'll see you next time in the locker room.